Welcome back to 23 ABC. Cleanup is underway in Northwest Bakersfield after a traffic collision and paint spill. 23 ABC's Alexa Ray is live at the scene with more on how lo long roads are expected to be closed. Good morning, Alexa. Good morning, Jess. Yes, yeah, so roads are expected to be closed for about several more hours. Not sure how many, but quite a few still as they are still cleaning up behind me, even though this accident did happen a little bit earlier this morning. I do want to step out of frame, though, so you guys can see what is going on. They're still trying to clean up the paint and solvent that was dumped after the truck that was attached to the trailer had their trailer flip over. Now, as you can see, they're kind of cleaning up the roads with a little bit of a paint remover there and as you can see coffee is going to be blocked off for quite some time because they are still trying to clear this out they are towing that truck out now the trailer still over on its side this truck did happen to cross over the median on coffee as it was involved in the accident they are towing the truck out right now the trailer they're still trying to get it cleaned up trying to pull a little bit out we aren't exactly sure how long the roads are going to be closed though now, when fire showed up earlier this morning, they tried to clean up the mess, but it was a little bit more than they could handle on their own. So they did have to call out environmental health in order to get it cleaned up. Now, they are helping in this process. When officials arrived on scene, though, thankfully nobody was injured. There was only a complaint of pain. They, got, they seemed to get everybody out. Everything was fine. They are still planning on having these roads shut down. Now, Olive was clear for the most part. You could drive along on it. Now, one lane is closed. And if you are planning on heading out here, just leave a little bit more time to get to where you're going because, as I said, these roads will be shut down for several more hours. I'm not sure how long Olive will be blocked off, but they did close one lane of traffic. But for the most part, Olive is moving pretty smoothly. There's a lot of debris on the ground. There's a lot that still needs to be cleaned up. So I would say to give it a couple more hours before things will be cleaned up.